Hunter Hunter episodes 35 and 36. So Gon has just received the okay from Hisoka that they're gonna fight. So he's training um, in various forms of magic. I know you guys hate it when I call it magic, but it's magic, okay? So there's this new category with six subcategories. Magic! <laughs> Wing is talking about how they have to choose a power that suits them for their individual styles. And he's like, well, Gon, for example, you're very um, flexible and you're springy and you lived in nature, so therefore your style should be this certain style. So depending on your style, if you learn certain styles that are closer to your style, then it's easier. But if you learn styles that are far away from your own style, then it will be harder. <laughs> oh, this is like the worst bit of animation of any show I've ever seen. Ugh. They're just like explaining various opponents they faced in the past and what their styles might have been. So how do we learn what style we fall into? One of the six subcategories. Well, there's this this thing where we get a wine glass and we put water in the wine glass and put the leaf on top of the water and then it tells us. Depending on what the water does, it tells them what their class is. Gon is what's called an, an enhancer. And Zushi is a manipulator. And um, Wing is also an enhancer. When Killua puts his hands around the glass, nothing happens. So nothing happened visually to the water, but it, it changed taste, it became sweeter, which means he's a transmutator. So everyone takes a couple of weeks to just train with the water. Just, you know, honing their skills to get prepared for their next battles. And Gon ar arranges for the day that he's gonna fight against Hisoka, and Hisoka's like, Oh boy, I can't stop thinking about it! So several weeks later, they're like, Wing, look what we can do! Killua goes first, and they're like, Oh my god, it's so sweet! Like, it's much sweeter than it was before. So it's not just potential, it's like, what you're capable of doing. And Zushi makes the leaf wiggle around in the water a little bit. And they're all like, nice job, nice job. Anyway, go on your turn! And it's like, psh, 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 water everywhere, like the glass breaks, just water pouring out. Just everywhere. So Wing's like, great job, go on Killua, you don't need me anymore. You graduate, Zushi, let's keep training. And Zushi's like, oh. Then Wing is like, go on, congratulations, you've officially passed the hunter exam. And they're like, what? The secret hunter exam, that is. See, you have to learn this magic technique before you become a hunter. So we go around and we train potential hunters in order to use magic. Wing is like, Killua, you should totally take the hunter exam again. You'll become a hunter next time. I know it. And Killua's like, whatever. So Hanzo and Kuropika have both learned about magic. And the little archer kid, Pokal, is struggling. Um, Leoreo is studying for the medical school, and they're like, Hisoka and Illumi already know about magic, so we don't have to worry about them. We, we didn't bother. So this is goodbye. Farewell, Wing. Continue train with Zushi. Anyway, the day of Hisoka and Gon's battle has arrived! <laughs> Everyone is just like going crazy, super excited to see this match. Like, the stands are just full. So both opponents come down to the, the ring with the fire behind them, and it's just super pumped. So if Hisoka wins, then he gets the challenge of Floor Master upstairs, but if he loses, then he goes all the way back down to ground zero, level zero. So the battle begins, and Gon immediately starts flailing at Hisoka, and Hisoka's just dodging. Hisoka's gotten in a few hits, but Gon never falls down, so he hasn't gotten any points yet. Gon's goal is really just to, to punch Hisoka in the face, like he was challenged to do so. So they, they fight, they fight, they fight, and they back off. Hisoka gets one point. So Gon lifts up a piece of the floor, hurls it at Hisoka, and while Hisoka's all like distracted by all this the rubble around him, Gon dives in. Oh, and he totally hits her in the face! Oh, that was nice! Whew. Hisoka's never been happier though, and the narrator warns us that Hisoka's true power is up ahead. So, uh, let's watch the next episode. So anyway, Hisoka's like, that didn't hurt so much. He's over it. And now there's this other announcer who's just like glorious looking with like long flowing locks. We've never seen this guy before. But enough about that, back to the fight. <laughs> so the two walk towards each other and Gon takes out the number card and hands it back to Hisoka. And Hisoka takes it like a gentleman. That was nice. Now it's back to the fight! 
And he so I was like, you must be an enhancer of magic men. And um, Gon's like, wow, that's so cool <laughs> that you knew that. Hisoka is able to tell what type someone is based on their personality. And Hisoka is a transmutator, just like, um, what's his face? Killua. And Hisoka warns him, like, oh, transmutators, they usually change their minds really fast, and they hate things that they liked before, so keep that in mind. And it's very, like, underlying. Keep in mind that Killua might suddenly hate you! And it's like, ah! So now Hisoka's finally gone on the offensive, and he's <laughs> leaving quite the destruction path in his wake. Gon's kind of taking a moment where we're like, okay, I gotta, I gotta figure out what to do. And Hisoka has gotten many points for his abilities. So then Hisoka's about to use this ability and then it's like, quick, use your eye magic, gone! And then he does, and luckily he can see it. Just in time, he's been attached. His magic! <laughs> so Hisoka jerks Gon closer and punches him in the face. Ouch! So Hisoka's special, like, ability is to attach his aura, like, a rubbery bungee cord. And so he's attached it to Gon's face and keeps drawing him back to him and keeps hitting him every time he gets close. And then, you know, as Hisoka starts getting sneaky, that's when they start playing, like, the the Spanish tango music. <laughs> and so Hisoka's like, if you can figure out when I attached this to your face, then I'll give you a free hit! And Gon gets it wrong, so he's like, darn it, doll! <laughs> Hisoka's actually being a little nice and giving uh, Gon some hints for the next battle he encounters. If you can't dodge, then seeing the attack coming is not gonna help. So Gon is finally like, ah, I can't deal with this anymore. If I can't escape him, then I'm just gonna go towards him and hit him. And Hisoka's like, yes, keep doing that. <laughs> so Hisoka has decided that um, he has to let Gon mature a little more before he fights again. So he's like, yes, just hit me all you'd like. I'm just gonna stand back and allow it. Whatever. He's being, like, super creepy. <laughs> so if Gon gets hit one more time, then he loses. <laughs> and then he still hits him in the face with a rock. <laughs> it's not funny, but it is! So now Hisoka wins. Everyone's like, what? But you did what you came here to do. You you handed over the name card, the number card. Hisoka walks off and he's like, you did awesome, but you need more experience, so fight a whole bunch more. And then let's fight again! Next time, we're gonna fight in the real world though. Not with all these crazy rules, we're gonna have an actual fight. So now Hisoka gets to go upstairs and fight a floor master, which is great. Um, and Gon can fight again, anytime. So then Wing is talking to Gon and Killo and he's like, You know what guys? Good luck. Do your best. You're great. I love you. <laughs> he didn't say that, but he might as well have. They say goodbye to Zushi and Wing, and they're like, well, you know, we did what we came to do. We, we returned the badge to Hisoka, so we don't need to be here anymore, I guess. How about I go back to my home island and show off my hunter badge? And Kilo was like, hey, bro, I'm gonna come with you. And Gon's like, great. That was a really cute Huntaclypedia. Because <laughs> it was just Kiloa talking about how much he loves Gon. Anyway, that's the end of those two, ep two episodes that you guys really wanted me to watch. They were definitely exciting. I mean, I've seen better battles in shows, but it, it was it was good to watch. It was uh, it was very like oh snap type moments, you know, you know those moments. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna be watching these last two episodes of um, the Heaven's Arena arc, which I guess they're not even in Heaven's Arena, so it doesn't really matter. Um, and just adding it on to the York New City arc. So the next video will be an examination of episodes 37 through 42. And I'll see you next time for that. Bye!